hello guys what's up welcome back to a vlog so i need to get ready really quickly i just need to do let me put you over here i just need to do my skincare really quick because i am leaving it's what time is it it's 10 30 a.m and i have an appointment with my mom to go get my hair straightened <laughs> yes i mean you guys already know by the title but yes i'm going to get my hair straightened professionally you know why because i don't have time or the patience or the skill to straighten my hair myself like i i think it's just the patience i do not have the patience at all um i still want to film straight hair videos like you know how i straighten it again at home if something's like if i have a part of my hair that's frizzy or like little hairstyles and stuff like that so i definitely want to film a video like using some hair straightener tools which i'm going to use or i'm going to film i'm just applying my skincare but I was supposed to wake up today at 9 a.m. because I wanted to make myself breakfast and then I needed to go to, I had an appointment, go to get my car maintenance because it's like past due for maintenance. I went to sleep last night at 3.30 a.m. I don't know why I did that to myself because I literally looked at the time and I was like, damn, it's like 2.30 a.m. I should go to sleep because 2.30 is like, okay, it's, not, it's late, but it's not that late. I will still have enough energy to wake up. But no, 3.30 came and around 3, I'm already super tired when I wake up in the morning. So yeah, I did that to myself. That was my fault. And I wasn't even editing. I was supposed to edit last night and I didn't. I just, I was just on TikTok. I don't know what to wear. All I live is in sweats because I gained weight. That's why. I need to buy more sweats that way yeah that way i just like but oh i did buy sweats the other day but i'm not gonna wear them today because i don't want them to get dirty they're more on the expensive side they were, they were 70 dollars which i know to some people that could be like normal but i've never bought sweats that are that expensive so yeah oh my god maybe rock brother where you at you should think that i wasn't bad enough and you should think that i wasn't bad enough I have so much to do today. That's what I do. Oh my god, I don't have hand sanitizer. Oh my god. Oh my goodness, I just noticed I didn't really make any like transition videos from going curly to straight. Oh my god, what type of influencer am I? <laughs> okay guys, hair reveal. So this is my hair. Let me show you guys a better my hair it's super long and it's sleek straight i actually went with my mom because we both got our hair strands and she wanted to be like me and copy my color so she got her hair toned down just like my hair um i just straightened my hair and that's it and it's so funny because when we went to go pick up my little sisters my mom went to go pick up one sister or you know her daughter <laughs> my sister and then i went to go pick up my other sister um because they come out of like two different exits and i went to go pick up my sister alexa and she kept looking at me and then she looked like straight like past me and i was like alexa it's me it's lynn she was like oh my god is it really you i did not notice like i thought you were mama at first because you looked like her but then you were a little too short and looking like a teenager to be her so i was like no it is me so i had to take my sunglasses off to show her but so funny so yeah my hair is just straight down i don't know if i like my hair parted in the middle or to the side but right now it's like in the middle because that's how she styled it. But yeah, I just ate a taco. I'm about to eat a concha. Hold on, I have to cancel some reservations, but I'm not sure if I want to go to the grocery store. I should because I kind of need to pick a few stuff up, but I kind of don't because um, I already have dinner. My mom sent me home with food as she usually does if she has food in the house or she cooks. So I already have that. I have pork cutlet with a potato it's already cooked i just have to mash, mash it and add sour cream and you know season it or whatever so that's good i just need like some fruits my sisters are sleeping over tomorrow so i definitely need more snacks and more fruits for them i for sure do not want to get the virus i know some people are like i don't care like if i get it i get it i'm not tripping i don't want to get it i know if you know it's my time to get it it'll be my time to get it but i definitely try to be safe and like i really do not want to get it at all you some people have headaches for months some people can't taste for months that's horrible i love food way too much to not be able to taste like i love i love food way but way but way but 
way too much to not be able to taste so or smell like you can't smell you can't taste you know how horrible that is like yes you could have you know worse things happen to you my grandmother passed away from coronavirus a few months ago i think it was back in october and yeah and it was very quick and she was very healthy she was only 60 i think she was like 62 early 60s um 60 years old and she was healthy she took her vitamins all the time ivf did all of that hydration everything like she was very she was very good very healthy um and looked out for herself and she, you know it happens really quick she passed away from it and it was very unfortunate and that's why i take you know i just get really mad when people are very insensitive about it like yes i get it i, I don't care when people say i'm over this virus or blah, blah blah like i am over it too like trust me i'm over it we still have to wear our masks because we just have to protect each other protect protect yourself protect you know someone's grandma someone's mom it's just wear it like don't make it a big deal when you get into your car take it off if you're walking in the street and there's nobody around or you know everyone's like at a distance maybe you can take it off like sometimes i take it off when i'm in the street and there's nobody around um or if i'm in the park and there's you know barely any people but if i'm in you know a grocery store or an establishment or crowded places i definitely wear it because i just feel weird also like if i wasn't wearing it i would feel like oh my goodness i'm getting sick right now like i do not like i don't like that but it's crazy how some people are very ignorant and i know everyone has different views and that's okay but some people are just very very insensitive to the situation and they're like i don't even want to say just hearing people talk about like not caring and it's not real and people are not getting sick or i just like i can't believe i have to get tested before going on a flight it's like what make it make how use your brain like you're going into another state or country possibly you know infecting residents at that state or country and yeah like it's your choice to travel i'm not saying don't travel but don't be ignorant and be mad when you know you find out that you have to get tested before going on a flight it's just right like you have to get tested i know that you can still catch you know corona the coronavirus um you know right before your flight or on the taxi or on the way to the airport like i get it but i think it's still good to get tested three days before or a day before whatever i think it's like three days before you travel it's for everybody's safety it's okay to have your own opinion but it's not okay to be like insensitive at a time like this you know some a pe freaking pandemic hello guys i don't know where i left off last time but i think look at my little baby i think i left i think i was at my mom's house and then i forgot to vlog ow today is monday and i'm just going to film i already filmed like a little tiktok makeup video and now i'm going to film retouching my hair i strained my hair on thursday and i haven't retouched it i haven't straightened it at all so i'm going to straighten it and retouch it now so my hair is straightened it looks so good i used the dyson hair straightener and i really do like it it died on me really fast and i don't know why so that's a little weird but it does have a charging dock so while you're not using it or you're doing something else you charge it but still i feel like it doesn't charge fast enough anyways i am going to go grocery shopping i'm going to aldi because i heard it's very inexpensive it's a european brand and they do have a lot of organics or everything there is organic and i'm tired of spending so much money on groceries and i need to save money so yeah let's go to aldi and i'm also going to ikea I'm at Ikea! <laughs> mm. 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 So I have canker sore. It's not contagious at all, but stress or like some type of spicy food or citrus food can cause it. And it hurts so much when I like talk and also when i eat and hot and like warm hot food so i'm struggling right now i did some grocery shopping at aldi's it's supposed to be more inexpensive and they do have organic stuff it's a european brand my mouth hurts the shit out of me because i have a canker sore i'm gonna try and make this quick because i really can't talk 
The first thing that I picked up is the flat bread. Oh, I heard so much. It's the first thing that I got. Second thing I got frozen wild cup pink salmon. And I like to keep frozen salmon just because um because I'm lazy and sometimes I don't like going to the grocery store, so I'd rather keep it like frozen and like accessible um whenever I'm hungry and don't really have food. I usually get the whole foods. Farm, I think that, yeah, this is from Whole Foods. The Whole Foods Farm Race Atlantic Salmon Fillets. It's 365 every day value, whatever. Um, and I really like this one, so hopefully the other one is just as good. I love fig bars. When I was younger, my mom always used to get me the fig Newtons um, as a snack, and I'm obsessed. But yeah, these look a little bit healthier. I'm actually gonna, no, I can't really eat. Baby spinach because I'm going to actually, since I can't really eat comfortably, I'm going to cook some spinach soup and yeah. I love coconut, so I got premium coconut cocoa ice cream bars. Frozen shrimp because I also like to have frozen shrimp. Handy because it's so easy to cook, so yeah, frozen shrimp. Hummus so I can have it with the carrots. I got these soups. I got green curry rice noodle soup. I got... Szechuan style noodle soup bowls. I heard they're really good. And udon soup bowls. So this is just like something fun to eat or for like lunch. Ooh, this one's good. I got Atlantic salmon already seasoned. I don't know how I feel about pre-seasoned stuff, but it's worth a try. That way I could just cook it and not really, you know, put in work in the kitchen. Coconut water. Rockefeller is so funny. He's in a bag. <laughs> Let me show you guys. I got organic non-GMO seven superfruits, 100% juice. I love me some Mexican cheese blend. Aldi doesn't have a lot of like known brands or American brands or just brands that you see at the regular grocery store. Um, so they didn't have silk. Hopefully, I do like this almond milk. If not, then uh, that's a big deal because I love like I need al almond milk whenever I get milk, and I like a specific like silk almond original or unsweetened milk but they actually do have starbucks cold brew unsweetened so that's like what i get that's the cold brew that i get well i get a lot of cold brew but i like that one too so they have that so that's good <laughs> what are you doing you're such a cutie oh my god oh my god I got Nescafe Classic Coffee, Instant Coffee, because um, sometimes when I have croissants, I like to, or eat croissants, I like to dip it in just instant coffee, this one specifically. I don't really like my croissants with cappuccinos. And this one just tastes so much better with the croissant, and also when my family comes over, sometimes they prefer this coffee over the um, Nespresso, even though they do have an espresso at home, but they always have this at their home, so I'm kind of like copying them. Got non-flatbread. Potatoes! A lot of potatoes. They didn't have like individual ones, so I have a lot, but I can make home fries. Oh, wow. Oh my God. Ow. He's trying to calm my leg. Ow. It hurts, Rockefeller. He's like, didn't you want to pick me up? And honey wheat bread. So I think I got like 26, 27 items in total, and they all came out to like $93. And let me check my phone. But when I shop at Whole Foods or like um this other local market by my house it, i always spend over like 120 150 dollars for like less than 20 things so let's see it hurts so much it really feels like certain parts of your mouth are sore and it hurts it hurts to eat anything like it hurts to talk to just because it, it's a sore like any any type of pressure ow oh! any type of pressure hurts so I can't find my in my Whole Foods receipt because I think it goes to my mom's email since it's her Amazon. I ordered from Instacart the other day and I ordered from this local grocery store that's kind of expensive. I bought 18 items and it came out to $97 and here I got I guess 10 more items or 8 more items and it was $93 so that's good saving money even though it's only like ten dollars but still it adds up um and then yeah and then instacart is a little expensive too but it could be convenient but the other time i ordered 21 items and it came out to 118 for 21 items 118 so see i got more than 21 items and it was only 93 dollars and i got organic stuff too so all right guys i'll see you in my next vlog because my mouth is like hurting